Okay, so here in Osaka, just saw this store here, Tokiwa, which is a second-hand camera store. And yeah, just curious to see what kind of cameras they have. So if you look super close, they got like the Contax 645 automatic. It's about 2,500 bucks. They got a bunch of old used uh, Leica digital cameras. So what I see here currently, you could get a Leica M monochrome for about 5,500 bucks. The Leica M-D, the one that doesn't have an LCD screen, it's about 6,000 bucks. And man, these contexts are getting stupid expensive. Like you could get a Contax T2 gold edition for 1,400 bucks. Man, it's pretty, uh, pretty cool selection of stuff. So let's go inside and let's see uh, what it looks like inside. All right, so pretty good prices on used Fujifilm cameras. So XE2 for about 400 bucks. Oh wow, this is actually really cheap. I used Fujifilm X-T2 for only a thousand bucks. It's pretty good. Oh, and I've actually been looking at the Olympuses. Wow, Olympus EM Mark One. Only 500 bucks. This is pretty good. And even the Sony A7, about 900 bucks. A7S2 body only, 2,000 bucks. Seems a little bit on the price. So, ooh, this is actually pretty good. I was actually looking at that. The Fujifilm X70, huge fan of that camera. It's only about 600 bucks used. I think they actually discontinued it. So let's see. So that's another good camera that I thought was cool. Ooh, okay. So if you look at the film like us, oh, that's actually really good. I use film like an MP black, for only three thousand five hundred dollars US. M7 for two thousand five hundred bucks, and of course I'm just translating from the Japanese. So about eight. Um, 80,000 yen, which is about 800 bucks for M5. M42, 1,200 bucks. M4, 3,000 bucks. Like uh, M4, 1,500 bucks. So a lot of people often joke, it's like, oh, you yeah, had to come to Japan. The first thing you have to do is get a used film. Like, oh, this is pretty cool. Nikon FA gold, about 2,000 bucks. So now I can understand why Bell Me Hunt, aka Japan Camera Hunter's job is so cool. You get all this stuff, taking a look at all this camera equipment. But yeah, the truth is actually, at a certain point you start looking at all this camera equipment, it all just kind of becomes the same thing and it becomes a little bit boring. To be honest, I think the most important thing in photography is to enjoy the shooting process. I'm actually pretty lucky that I just lucked out to be living so close to a camera store right here. Yeah, so definitely uh, if you're in Japan, especially in Tokyo, check out Map Camera or just Google Japan Camera Hunter Tokyo Camera Guides and see what's on the sale.